Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Revive Me and today I'm going to show you how you can install and play Sonic 1 SMS Remake for Xbox Dev Mode. All credit to the Xbox port by M-K. For this tutorial, all you will need is the Sonic 1 SMS Remake.appx file. You can find this file within the Xbox Dev Store. I will also have this link down below. And you can also find this within the Revive Community Discord, where you can get tons of support questions, help with anything that you're having trouble on, or also just discussing apps that could be ported to UWP. This is a brand new dev store created by Moonpower. It's completely updated, and it has all the latest versions of everything for UWP within this. And big shout out to everyone else who's also been contributing and helping out set up this dev store with Moon. I bet, so once you get to this page, all you gotta do is at the top, click on Games. And then we're just going to scroll down a little bit until we find Sonic 1 SMS Remake. This game is a redesigned version of the Master System released by Sega in 1991. Game files included. So then all you have to do is simply click on download. Then now we got to go into the dev portal to install the app. Now I'm going to show you the remote access at the bottom. So simply click on remote access settings. And what we're going to do is enable the Xbox dev portal. What this will do is this is where we will install our apps. We would have to do this from the computer or your phone. Make sure to keep a screenshot of this because anytime you want to enter the access portal on your computer, you're going to have to use either one or two links, whichever one works for you. And then at the bottom, there's an the authentication where you can set a password and username. Me personally, I just keep this unchecked. It's just a little easier to get onto the page without having to enter your information every time. And then what we're going to do is we're going to leave our Xbox on this page. I bet. So what we're going to do is switch over to the PC. We're going to enter in one of the links for the access portal. And then there's some settings we're going to change from there. And then you should be good to go. All right. Now that we're on the computer, what we're going to do is enter in one of those links. And yes, please add the HTTPS within it. And then once you enter in the link, you should get a page that says your connection is not private. Attackers might attempt to steal your information. Simply at the bottom, click on advanced and proceed. I bet. So once you get to the dev portal, all we got to do is underneath my games and apps, click on add. And all we're simply going to do is drag and drop that Sonic 1 SMS remake file right into it. Click on next. There's no dependencies needed, so just press start. Once it says package successfully registered, just click on done. And then what we're going to do is head over to dev mode, start our app, and make sure it's working. I bet. So once you're on dev mode, what you want to do is hover over the app, press the select button on it, go to view details. And if it's not set to a game, make sure to change it from an app to a game. And then once you do that, start it right up. And that's pretty much it. You just installed Sonic SMS Remake for Xbox Dev Mode. If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a like. And if you enjoy content like this, make sure to give a follow for more videos. I hope you guys have a great one.